Oh, Joe's tougher than a $2 steak. There's no doubt about that. It's going to take a hell of an effort from a tandem of offense to get him down. And look at that. The re rehabilitative power, the energy. Uh, it's just amazing. And Wardlow gets the tag from Samoa. Joe and Wardlow. Very timely tag, to say the least. Coming in. Oh. Whoa. Released him. Just tossing Bishop Khan. And now Wardlow, a second one. Ability to back release suplex can be very effective. Wardlow spotted Toa Leona creeping in. Toa breaks the grip of Wardlow. Swing and a miss. Wardlow, German there. Use the ropes for some momentum. He needed to do so, Tony, for a 300 pounder to get suplex. Use whatever you can, JR, to get the band up and over. Wardlow spikes Bishop Khan. Wardlow looking for the cover. Two, and no, Toa Leona breaks it up. And remember, coming up Saturday, November 19th, it's full gear, the main event for the AEW World Championships, the richest prize in our sport. It'll be John Moxley looking to defend against MJF. And we also know MJF had been wiped out by the firm recently on Dynamite, but we understand MJF will be there at full gear. And the acclaimed will take on Swerve in our glory for the AEW World Tag Team Championship, the third part of the trilogy. Tony Storm and Jamie Hayter for the AEW Interim Women's World Championship, plus the Ring of Honor World Championship four-way match. Chris Jericho, Sammy Guevara, Brian Danielson, Claudio Castagnoli. And how many titles do you think may change on this pay-per-view? I'm glad to see that MJF is going to make it because he was hammered by the firm the last time we saw it. Oh, what a right, right. hand by Wardlow, who just hammered Prince Nana. Yeah, he got hammered. Oh, Bishop Khan, roll up there, too. No. Oh, what a knee strike. Wardlow kicked out and rolled right through in the same motion. Amazing where with it all. Yeah, you're right, Escar. That knee strike rocked his head. Headbutt. Yeah, but he was able to come back with a headbutt. Wardlow trying to clear the cobwebs. Now the straps go down. 6'3", 275, something like that. Those headbutts are nasty. And so are those power bombs from the TNT champion Wardlow. And one is never enough. And just hoisting up Khan and on the outside, Samoa Joe. Yep. He's got to hold Leon in a sleeper. Khan in Good serious Lord. trouble here. Car crash after he's car gonna, crash. He's gonna make it four. A quartet. A quartet of power bombs. The cover. And the win for War Joe's. The winners of this match, the Ring of Honor wow. World Television Champion and TNT Champion, War Joe's. Impressive tag team victory for this team that seemingly are this close to being unbeatable. Amazing two athletes, a high impact, big time main event. <laughs> And we are not oh. done yet. Wardlow, he called out powerhouse Hobbs. And Hobbs, the last two times we've seen him, he left Wardlow laying. Look at how, look at how good. Oh, look at Wardlow, just went right past Joe. Look at how he, good uh, Hobbs looks, man. He's been training so hard for what's next. He pushed Joe back and stood right in front of him and said, come on, come get me. And I don't think Joe appreciated that. Well, powerhouse Hobbs making his intentions clear. He wants Wardlow. He wants the TNT championship.